Hello everyone, Berserkhead here again, and this is the fourth part of this let's play of uh, the stainless steel mod. Okay, let's get to it. I besieged Dublin last turn, and this time I'm going to assault. Uh, it's going to be an easy battle because I've already defeated most of uh, most of the rebel armies, really many of them, and now they have just one or two units in there, so. They will be no match for my army. Okay, I'm just waiting for it to load. And we get to it. Good. Let's hear the general. There's work here for the sword, the axe, and the knife. Young fools need a little trimming! Good, we could hear some Scottish accent this time. And I'm going to... Um, I'm going to place both of my rams from this side because it's just useless to divide my army and then uh, gather it together again. It just doesn't make sense. Okay, I do this the standard way. Cavalry behind, ramps in the front, and infantry in between them. Okay, let's do that. And get everyone right there. And my cavalry as well. This will take some time, I can actually uh, rewind it like, like this. Okay, uh, now I should, should tell my army where to go. I want them here and these guys. These guys will be here on the first line. Oh, come on. Anyway, put them there. <coughs> Excuse me, I'm a little bit ill and uh, my voice may be different and this is the reason and I couldn't record the video for like two days just because of this uh, but now I'm better, I'm almost, I'm almost healthy again uh, Okay, anyways, that isn't important now Again I should make this go faster. Almost ready. Battering ram has done its work. Now what I want now here is, the time for is brave to get hearts and brave deeds. Uh, is to get my uh, archers first. And this side seems to be. Oh man, there is such a long marsh. March, excuse me. Then I get my. Oh, these guys should leave the ranks. The I Lord put, is with us today. We have captured the enemy's walls. Okay, we got the walls. Now I get my generals in as well. And I want them running. So here, what I'm going to do is to get my archers first. Uh, they will uh, they will start shooting. Hopefully I'll harass them as much as I can These guys as I said in the in the previous part were pretty vulnerable to archer fire so um, It should be no problem. I will inflict many casualties Okay, let's let's uh, make this go faster again because this battle is really boring you know, I'm, I'm a winner from the beginning and all that because they have just won one unit. They're completely no match. Okay, now I can get my archers first. I can make them march. I'll 
give them some advantage and then I'm going to to get my infantry going as well a little bit more good now get these guys going and my cavalry as well they will go this way good we got two of the gateways anyway uh, I don't need them Tell them where to go. They will deploy here. Okay. And then I will just get my infantry. Now place them right here before them. Oh wait, I should probably get this uh, to normal speed. Um, okay. Oh, they started charging here. Anyway, let's shoot them. March! Yeah, they won't charge me. I'm pretty sure about that. The AI, the AI never does that. Or if they charge me, they will. You see, they, they don't charge straight forward. Plus, they're go not going to charge my archers, they're going to go for my cavalry. Which is stupid because I'm going to shoot them from behind. Well, they have their shields behind, so maybe it's not that bad. Now they charge my archers. No, they don't. They actually don't. Come on, shoot them. You see how stupid the AI is. It's uh, nothing compared to a real player. So that's why you could play like uh, the campaign for years, but then go to multiplayer and you would suck. You would be like the worst player there. Just because it, it, it's so different. Okay, now I'm uh, shooting them from behind and I'm fighting them as well with my infantry. Okay, they will get some... They will inflict some casualties. They will get some archers, but this will just be minimal because you see... Our men are winning the battle! I'm we smashing only them half the enemy army flees the field. Good, and here Athens I'm going to end the battle because they're going to return to, to here, right here, and... and uh, I'll have to fight them again, so it just isn't worth it. They're not, they're not from a faction. They're just rebels. So good, I have Dublin, but still I don't have money. Yes, trading card is good. Uh, this gives him more income every turn. Good. So I end my turn. And lately I've played the vanilla version of the game and um, it seemed like um, it takes so much less time to... Oh, fuck. It, it, it takes so so much shorter time to, to load between the turns because... Um, because you, here you have so many factions and everything is more realistic and in the... In the vanilla version, there are less factions and everything is kind of the same. So it takes it takes about three seconds, but here it takes a little bit, uh, not a little bit, but much much longer. Uh, so yeah, you, you can see how much time. Okay, now I should get this settlement, which is uh, oh man, where is it? I think it's here, although I'm not I'm not really sure about it. Something to investigate. But I think I it is. I'll there. find a way to send my spy no there. Vantage point there sire. Good. Uh, and not my ships. Possible. These are my only ships. But I have I have my bishop there. Anyway, I don't care. Oh man, I'm losing money Aye, again. Captain. Fuck. Aye, 
What should I do? I should probably raise the taxes. People are happy, so it shouldn't be a problem. At least for now. This is a castle. And in Dublin. Well, yeah, it's not that bad. Okay, this turn was very short. I'm not doing well for now. Not at all. But this is Scotland. It's it's normal. If it is a faction that's really powerful from the beginning, like England, um, I would be so powerful up to this point. But this is Scotland, and they are one of the richest, fa uh, the um, poorest factions in the beginning. So yeah, it's kind of hard in the beginning. Rebels, and it's my turn again. take my spy on the ship no I'll have to wait on for one way. more turn okay I want some Sire, money that's good go further this day. and that's a lot of money actually let's see well what, what should I build here first I should retrain all of these units and then okay nothing here I don't have anything that's uh, that's that useful here I'll build this and I don't have money for anything else. Now let me plan what I do uh, later on. Um, first I'm planning to take... Oh, there is the castle. Uh, here, all parts of Ireland. I need that. And then this settlement here, there was a mission but I won't be able to complete it because I don't have the the Bye. army to do it and first I should send my spy and if they don't have that many troops in there I may send this army with uh, with which I conquered Dublin it might work although it's not very likely but it might uh, I'm optimistic okay almost finished yeah, it's, it's, uh, it's really irritating sometimes when it takes so much time. Come on. Okay, rebels. Good. Oh, mission expired. Oh, probably because the English got it. That's good for me because I will not have to send a spy there and ships and all that stuff. I'll just get my spy, Something to put him the right thing. there, Moving quietly. and they have pretty much no army, although these archers are kind of OP. Well, I should get some more men. No, 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 it's enough. They have cavalry and I have spearmen. They have archers. I have cavalry. Hobolars, these are uh, light cavalry, if I'm not wrong. So I just get I the ship and I send him I here she do that, Captain. in the in the southern part of the Iberian like Peninsula because uh, this is pretty I much Muslim right now because this is before the. Reconquista period, and you know, Iberia was most mostly Muslim, and there were some kingdoms. All this is probably a crusade. Uh, I don't know if I'm going to join the crusade because I don't have money, and for crusade you have to have money. Although you get them back, but only if you if you reach. If you reach the the subject, like the the town in which the crusade is, and uh, I'm pretty far away from it, so I might not be able to reach it first. The crusader states are so close; I just have no no time. And my ships are nothing; they're not that good. Yeah. The Holy Bible may okay, let's watch peace, this. But when it is Christendom itself that is threatened. Then it is every Christian's duty to defend all that is holy. 
His Holiness the Pope has called a crusade to reclaim the, the Holy Pope, Lands from the, the infidel, who would deny Christian pilgrims their right to visit the holy places. It is time for the armies of Christendom to put aside their differences and unite under one banner, the sign of the cross, and give back God's children what is rightfully theirs, or die trying. Good. Okay. Uh, there are already factions that joined Kingdom of uh, Hungary, Norway, the Holy Romans, and France. And... Uh, Hungarians are most likely to reach it. They're pretty close. Oh, sorry, my phone rang. I just have to talk and then. Okay, here I am again. I'm really, really sorry about this, but I was expecting this call. It was important and I had to pick it up. Okay, so uh, let's get back to it. These are all the factions that went on a crusade. Uh, they, they are now at war with the Fatimid Caliphate, which means that. Cairo is territory to the Fatimids. Yeah, pretty, pretty obvious. And I have money now. I could build pretty much anything I want. Now I will get the taxes to normal because I want my population to grow. And uh, yeah, because if it doesn't grow, I cannot Something to investigate. Um, develop On technologically. Okay, they have some archers not a big deal here they have one more unit of these archers spearmen these are not bad actually well they're as good as the spear militia I think no they're a little bit better anyway I have much more so yeah okay I get one of my generals this what? guy and I get my archers. I can. I. Although I may wait to. Yeah, I'll just wait to retrain these guys and then I'll do it the next turn. Here, I will have to build something. Like, let's build a brothel. And in Dublin, I'll just build a church. So that the Pope hopefully won't get I angry can. with me. Uh, because I didn't join the crusade. I have more time to do it, but I don't think it's worth it. Just that's the reason. And it's not very likely for someone to attack me at this point. Because the only faction that has interest in attacking me is England. And now I'm in alliance with them. And this is normal difficulty, so they won't, they won't stab me. They won't betray me. And if I take this castle right there and I have possession of all Ireland, then I I will see I will see what I will do. My goal is to to attack England and destroy England, destroy the faction. And this is going to be very difficult because they don't have just armies in Britain. They have uh, they have Normandy as well. So they're a big kingdom, especially in the beginning. More faction, more factions joining the crusade. The Danish, good. Uh, yeah, now I stabilize my economy. Uh, that was everything that I wanted. Now here, um, what should I get? This, this, or this? Let me see. I don't have archers, but. Well, oh fuck, my phone rang again. Okay, anyway, I'll uh, continue. Okay, I'm here again. This time, at least my phone was in, in silent mode, so you didn't hear it ringing. Well, um, I cannot get any archers from anywhere at this point, so I will get this after all. And um, I will get my armies out of the town. Command me! Just hopefully the uh, this the public order won't drop down. No, it won't. It's it's enough. What? Okay, I, so I get these guys. I I'll get this silent rebel. Get just one unit of spearmen. I. And. 
Yeah, this is it. Okay, it's it's enough. Slaughter them, sire. Good. Set watches. We rest. Uh, I cannot do anything else at this point, so I will end my turn. And this video will probably be going until I besiege the castle. Oh, I should I should see its name. Um, the Irish castle. Oh come on now. Everything that's happening around Cairo uh, can be seen by any Christian faction right now because there is a crusade for Cairo and this is my ship right there it's uh, it's almost uh, reached its target I'm I'm actually just drop the priest right there and uh, anyway I will I will see what I will do and it is my turn again uh, more factions Kingdom of Aragon and the Crusader States Kingdom of Aragon are uh, uh, these are Kingdom of Leon and Kingdom of Aragon are here like Catalonia this part of the map and I just drop my priest here good. there is a cardinal yes, your majesty. which is not good because he will convert most people and not my priest I continue winning money that's good okay now I now I have pretty good economy um, what should I build here I'll get the ballista maker I don't see a reason in doing this but I just have to build something now as I have money I may actually get these armies yeah, like this rebel army in open field battle and then I'll besiege the town and they will just have one unit of archers again like the same thing that happened to Dublin yeah I think it's a good idea okay I have to wait again it's uh it started getting irritating because I don't play all that much I just wait and now as there is a crusade around Cairo I have to see everything that's happening there and I really don't want that because I'm not participating in the crusade. Almost my turn. Good rebels. Um, they're attacking me, so open field battle it is, good. Hmm. There are two armies, but they're both coming from like in front of me, so Leave no enemy there will be no ambushes or stuff like that. Ah, uh, oh fuck, it's a forest not good I hate forests because I don't have that much visibility I know that I can hide pretty much any troop but I just don't like it because I don't see anything you see my shields are, are white and and uh, and blue and everything's white and it's just so confusing although all my troops are hidden and I'll move my general somewhere away from them so that they don't know my location. The enemy have brought up more men. They hope to make up in numbers what they lack in courage. Uh, I'm just a little bit worried about these archers because they're really much better than mine, but I have I have a general so I'll deal with them. And these light cavalry units 
my spearman will deal with them pretty easily and these guys they're better than uh, than my spearman but they're just less in numbers okay let's uh, make this go faster again like six times the speed and you can see they're going for my general they don't know where my units are and now I will start shooting if I can um, I can't at this point but oh I should remove this I don't use it anyway yeah they started shooting now but they're shooting in, at me as well They managed to kill some units. I'll get my general right here so that I can uh, can charge right into these archers. And um, they couldn't kill that many units. Now I can just charge them. But I'm not seeing anything. It's so hard. They're charging my general. Well, it won't happen. I should, I should uh, try to get them here. Oh, look at these archers! They killed so many, so many of my men. And uh, here, my spearmen should overwhelm, overwhelm these guys. And again, I'm not seeing anything, but I suppose I'm winning. Uh, good. Now I should should probably get a hammer and anvil, but the battle is very much in our But favor. I should first if we remain just kill true these steadfast, archers. Victory will be ours. Here, I I don't know if I'm actually winning, but here I'm pretty sure I'm winning. Oh wait! No! Don't go! No! Wait! No! Wait, my Highland Rebel, go there. My General, right there. Oh, these guys uh, broke. Good. Then I'll get these guys for camera and angle. And these guys are retreating as well. Good. I'll chase them with my horses. Now look at this. Oh. They will die so far. The enemy are badly bloodied. Just look at they the way their, their numbers are dropping. And they have one more unit coming from here. And there are again just archers. So I, I will just rush anyone into their direction. I don't care about fatigue and stuff like that. Uh, they will do it. Uh, I've already won this battle, they cannot win it just by one archer. And here I'm trying to kill as many as possible. But you can see the forest just bought my horses. They are not doing what they should. And look at these archers, just killing my troops. And these guys came back from routing, so I should I should send some troops there. Oh man, fucking forest! Hate that. Your cavalry is completely useless. The forest, and now they're killing my my general troops. Getting hammer and Good, I got them. Got these bastards. Now here, the enemy general has again they're retreating. He flees the field of battle and abandons his men. Oh, I will kill you now. I got Good you. tidings. The enemy general lies dead. Okay, the we general is dead. The they're not coming back. 
Look how our them. cowardly foe runs. It is time to press the attack. And they're dropping... They're killing some of my troops, so I just charge them. But I'll get my general for hammer and ammo. Because they continue shooting and they still kill some of my guys. Although this is a melee combo. They can still just kill some of us. Look at this. Only half the enemy force remains. Look at this. These are actually my archers. No, they're not. They're not shooting. But just in case they are, I'll just leave them at some random location so that they will stop shooting. Now this hammer and anvil will just broke them immediately. Break them. Me. The enemy Good. army flees the field. Now I should kill as many them, as possible the because down. they will retreat to the city and then I'll have to fight them after I besiege it. So I have to kill as many units as possible so that they will have smaller force there. These are just nine. So I'll deal with them, but I need to, to catch these guys if possible. Well, probably not. 54, well, they were 150 and this is... Uh, yeah, I killed, I killed most of them, but still they are 54. They could do some damage. I just hope that my general will, will reach them and he has now silver experience which is pretty good but I want him to to go to gold because then his unit is just great I will again put this in max speed Oh, come on! Kill them. They couldn't kill that many. Completed, your Majesty. Oh, man. And I stopped the battle here. By Saint Andrew, our foe is utterly vanquished. Well, I lost some men, but day, I killed more, it and the there's some that I captured. So now I can lay siege. the Your castle. Ah! It's called Galway. Good. Um, let me see Jack. Let me see how many they have in there. Something to invest Oh, it, it, it's mine. Oh, good. So they didn't go, go back to the castle. They just Oh great, so free uh, yeah. castle for me, good. No siege battles, nothing, just like that. More factions, uh, all the Italian factions joined now. And um, what should I get here? I will... Uh, oh, okay, I'll get this. Which will give me levy archers, which are not the best unit, but... Still, there are some archers. And in Edinburgh, I should build this. And here, I just get the Ballista Maker because for now I just have one in Dublin that, that is still under construction. But I don't have on. Uh, I just have one in Ireland and I don't have uh, here on uh, in Britannia. I just don't have any. So. Yeah. Oh, the Byzantine Empire and the Seljuks are at war. Good. So, I think this is a good moment to stop the video. I got two settlements, which is nice. Now, uh, let me see how powerful I am. Um, this is me, and uh, this is England. Well, they're still more powerful, but... I'll see. Let's see. Military. Well, okay, anyways. Um, I'll think about it later. So. Okay. Um, this is where I stop the video. See you next time. Goodbye.